Hi guys, so in this today video I'm going to do another LEGO City update. So I would like to get apart the whole city and uh, rebuild it because I don't really like that they are like too much roads. So if you look like roads, roads all around here, then in the middle we have this uh, skate ring, but of course under that there are also roads the skate park but that's also with roads here at the side we have this lego stand with the customer and that's also roads so i think that uh, they, are, they are like just too much roads in the city so uh yeah i would like to get apart the whole city and build a new one but of course before i get it apart i will do a picture so if i don't like it i will build it back to this one so I think let's move the vehicles. So the car eyes and the vehicles are removed. Now it's turn to remove the minifigures. So the minifigures are removed as well. The next step I think is to remove the buildings. Let's do it. So now the buildings and the skate park is removed. It's time to remove these street lamps, bushes, uh signs the these traffic lights the skate rings uh that piece and yeah let's do it so after i remove everything except the roads uh, i'm almost there to start building but of course first we uh, have to get these apart so uh i finish getting apart the roads and i also clean the table so it's not dusty i didn't take apart some stuff like this uh, ice swing because i know that i'll use this one as it is and uh, i also got the leftover pieces so in here i keep i have two more road plates lots of these ramps and some extra of these tiles and of course the street lamps and stuff like that which i took down and here is the rest of it so i have quite much of these new road plates like i have the shopping street, the family house, the skate park, and four of the road base plate, base plate sets. So uh, I have lots of these plates. And now I think uh, I will start building it. So before uh, starting to do the city, I decided to do some more organizing. So I took out all the tiles from all of these plates and also from these ones uh, except the skate rink I didn't get this apart so these are these plain ones these are the ones with the stripe these with uh, to the skate park to put the ramps on it these are the ones to these crossings so these ones and these one by fours and here i have all of the ramps well lots of ramps and uh, i also uh, took off the tiles from these uh, stuff here so yeah now it's time to start doing the city so after starting to do the outlines here is the city looks like uh, well, as you can see, still lots of work to do, but uh, it's kind of showing you the outlines where the roads will be. Of course, it can change. So, yeah, I'll continue building it. So, after some more working, here it is. So, a uh, lot more outlines and things like that. Like, now also have the skate park. And uh, I'm thinking to not put back the fire station because it's 
kind of like an old set. I think it's from 2011 or uh, 12. I don't know. But so yeah, it's quite an old set and it doesn't really uh, fit with these new 2021 road plate set. It it like much it would look much better with the old road plate set. But yeah, I think I'm not going to put it in the city. But of course, who knows? I will see it later. So after more working, here it is. Uh, well, uh, I like what is finished, but there are some kind of like unfinished parts, like here and over here. I don't know what should I put. Uh, maybe I could put back the fire station, but the problem with that, if I integrate it over here, like uh, city sets, this one also has an open back. And uh, unfortunately, I don't have any of the creator expert modu modular buildings, which have the closed backs. And I don't really want to put an open back building over here. So I still have to uh, think about that, like what should I do? So uh, now let's continue it. So after more building, here's what I got. So uh, I put these small bushes, instead of putting them here, I put them there because now it isn't so empty and it's kind of like a park or something like that. So it's a green place. I like that it looks quite cool. And uh, over here, uh, I put these fences or gates like so they separate this and this is kind of like a, a place where uh, people can skate uh, skate in the park or do some hockey or stuff like that so it's kind of like a playing place where people can spend their free time outside so that's quite good but I still don't have any ideas what to put over here. Uh, so I don't know. Uh, of course here it won't stay so empty because I will put street lights and these tiles, which of course will make it much better. But yeah, uh, of course, still lots of things to uh, do and think of how to do it. So now I will continue the building. So now I'm for unfortunately I ran into a smaller problem. So the table isn't enough big. On this side uh, the ramps over here uh, hang off the table or if I push it so it's good over there, then these uh, street lamps over here put it closer so you can see it better, uh, but yeah, it, it can be seen so it uh, isn't so good. I'm thinking about uh, getting off these ramps because uh, yeah, I think uh, it's better than not having any street lights on that long place or any signs or these speed limits or anything like this. So yeah, I think I will not put any uh, ramps over there. So yeah, now I will uh, put more lamps and street lights and stuff like that. So uh, now I've done some more uh, modifications. So uh, I have one leftover road plate, but now the Vestas wind turbine is over here. And uh, it's not too good. It would be like cool to have roads going over here and here, but unfortunately this is my only leftover base plate. So uh, now I couldn't do that. 
but in the future I plan on getting the town center from the Lego City Road playsets. That's the only one which I don't have here in my collection. And uh, that uh, would be very good to the city. Uh, I would have more the roads, uh, buildings and stuff like that. So yeah, that would be very good. But uh, now here is what I got. I like this new layout. I don't think I'll do the old one. Uh, but as I said, this isn't so good that here and there isn't anything. Well, uh, now I figured that maybe I could do that. Take out this and continue the road over here. But would that be better? I don't know. I'll st still try it out. And after I tried that out, I'll show you what I've done. And then I'll start placing the cars and the minifigures. So now I'll try it out. So now I've come up with a very good uh, solution over here. So uh, I started running out of the 2x4 tiles which connect these. And I didn't want to use these ones. I like the, to use these ones only at these uh, crossings. So I decided to put a crossing here and now I could use these ones. And uh, then uh, I uh, put two ramps over here. So now uh, it has enough place. But if you get it out, it's kind of like empty, so it looks quite good uh, over here. So that's a good solution. And I still have one of these and four of these, which I said I don't really like using uh, at normal places. I only like using that at these crossings. And I like, uh, sorry, I have one of these uh, plates left as well but I don't really know where should I put it so that's just a leftover but uh, here I would like to put two ramps but uh, the problem with that is I would like to put one of these printed tiles with the stripes on it so like you can go over there bit but I'm out of them I would only need one of those but I don't have any more uh, I used all of them, but uh, I think I'll try to do it. Maybe I can find a solution like I found one over here as well. Now I'll try it. So I was trying to find solutions, but I couldn't get out any of those uh, printed tiles. Like I don't want to get out any of the stripes. I don't even want to get out these from these uh, signs. So yeah, I don't want to get it out from anywhere. So I just left it like that. Uh, so uh, if I will find a solution, then I will do a separate video in the future. But now I think I will place first the vehicles and then the minifigures. So I've uh, started placing them, but uh, I still need to find out uh, what vehicles or other cars should I put because if I move the fire station, so like now it isn't in the city, then I won't even put the cars which belong to the fire station. Or I don't think I'll even put this one because as you remember this was at the lego stand i think i'll put the lego stand somewhere i still don't know where but i don't think i'll need a customer because if you remember then there were two roll plates and uh, that was enough place but now i don't have that much place so i think i'll just put the lego stand somewhere where this place like maybe on the white table 
or somewhere in the corner or maybe over here so we yeah, are still find out that but i will put it then uh, i will put that uh, stand when i'm placing the minifigures so now i find out what vehicle sh should i put so uh, i decided to put this little construction car <coughs> over here and uh, the i put these uh, things over here which it comes like there is a road build and like for example he's just going home for on work or i don't know and uh, here is the this from closer it also has that rat which the set came with so i think it's quite cool that here you have this like construction place so yeah uh, now come the minifigures let's do it so while placing the minifigures i've come up with a pretty cool idea to change the vestas wind turbine so before it was like this but i think it looks better like this and uh, so yeah it's facing inside the city which is quite good now i will have to change some of the vehicles like it would look better to have that over there i don't know where to put that one and i still need to find for the uh, place for the lego stand but uh, the rest of the mini minifigures were uh, placed uh, where they actually were so the people in the skate park were the same as well these hockey players were the same this bicycle was also there and i actually placed both of these flags and uh, i think it looks good inside there so it isn't so empty so yeah now i have to find a place for the lego stand and a little bit uh, rearrange the vehicles so this one will get a nice place as well let's do it so now i placed the lego stand over there in the middle he's selling the lego sets in the park so people can come here to the park and buy some lego and uh, i put this road worker over there that is like going to work or uh, yeah or maybe i could just put it closer and get out the minifigure and like he's working yeah i probably do that so now the minifigure is over here and it, he's working and he parked his construction vehicle over there so yeah uh, the last thing uh, i have to do is maybe put some more vehicles because as you can see here it's kind of like empty uh, yeah i will uh, try to find another vehicle which looks good in the city i have a lot of lego city vehicles but uh, these ones are those which look the best in this lego city and came with the new road plates and yeah but i will try to find some other vehicles so uh, now i put the car which came with the skate park over there put the vestas repair car over there and put this uh, car over here this race car buggy transporter set it's just going out of the city and i think it uh, it fits quite good in the city it is also a 2021 lego city set so uh no i don't know what should i do am i finished 
Well, I will stay ill tinker a little bit. So I've come up with another cool uh, thing to put this uh, animal rescue set over there. I put two ramps over there and yeah, that's kind of like a um, place where, like a wildlife place, not too big and not too much details, but yeah, that set isn't bad over there. I also have this animal rescue hovercraft set, but uh, yeah, I think that one is enough over there, so I don't think I'll put this set in the city. So now by adding every detail to my city, I can say that it is finished. So it has changed uh, quite much uh, from the last one, so the first one, but I think it's much better. So. Uh, of course, we have the shopping street set, the family house, Vesta's wind turbine, and the skate park. And of course, four of the road plate sets. So here we have this construction area on the road. Then, of course, we have cars all over the city. In this park place, uh, this guy is selling Lego, so there's the Lego stand. The skate park hasn't changed much, the minifigures are doing the same thing. And so didn't the uh, ice rink or this hockey, uh, the minifigures are the same way as well. Uh, then I added another set to my uh, city, this race. A buggy transporter. Of course, the Vesta Swing Turbine is here. And here is this small animal rescue set. Uh, I think it isn't bad over there, it looks quite good. And unfortunately, I don't have any of these striped tiles, so I couldn't put that over there, but it would be good. So yeah, I'm pretty happy with this new layout. Uh, maybe in these few days I'll do some smaller changes and I'll do another video for that. But yeah, I'm pretty happy with this uh, new LEGO City layout. So uh, make sure to uh, write your opinion in the comment section below. Which one do you like better? the new one or the old one and uh, uh, stay tuned for my future videos and don't forget to like and subscribe and goodbye